Hey everyone, it's Karen from Mayfly Life. Today, with all these products here, I'm going to make a natural dishwashing rinse agent. Stay tuned. Okay, everybody. I decided uh, that I was going to make a, uh, a homemade uh, rinse agent uh, for my dishwasher. Uh, since I do have um, naturally made, uh, handmade uh, dishwashing tabs instead of uh, store-bought. And I thought, you know what, I didn't have anything for a rinse agent, so I'd use Jet Dry. So that was kind of defeating the purpose, so I figured I'm going to hunt down uh, a recipe that I can uh, try and see what it's like and pass along the recipe to you guys. Uh, now I've seen several different uh, recipes. This one contains only uh, four major ingredients uh, for um, and I did. One thing I did do is I checked uh, the natural uh, products aisle uh, in my uh, local uh, superstore and uh, I checked to see what the ingredients were and sure enough citric acid was in there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add all my ingredients in this uh, Pyrex uh, cup and give it a mix and we'll uh, see how it goes. Okay, so what I need is half a cup. Now if you guys want, you can, um, you can, do, you can cut this in half, but I'm going to do the whole thing. This is half a cup plain white vinegar. Now what the white vinegar uh, is, is it's a mild acid and it helps break up mineral deposits so that's why I'm using it in this uh, recipe. I'm also using the same amount, half a cup, of rubbing alcohol. I'm placing it in my bowl, my Pyrex ware. And what uh, rubbing alcohol is, is it's an organic solvent apparently. Uh, it helps with water spots, streaks, and cloudy mineral deposits. So uh, it, uh, it's actually like a double whammy uh, powerhouse for, uh, with the, the vinegar. And to this concoction, I'm going to mix in two tablespoons of citric acid. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to give it a stir till it's dissolved. Now what uh, the citric acid does is it uh, helps to kill bacteria, mold and mildew. It's also effective on soap scum, water stains and calcium and lime deposits and rust. So, but you're going to give this a good mix until it's all dissolved. And this is basically what Jet Dry and any other type of rinse agent is like. So we'll give it a good mix and I'll see how, how much it's dissolved. Yep, it's pretty dissolved. Now what else I'm going to do is I'm using um, uh, lemon essential oil and lemon essential oil is a degreaser. It also helps to eliminate hard water spotting. It sanitizes, removes tarnish from cutlery and metal um, bakeware. So this is a great uh, option uh, for uh, fragrance. If you want to, you can use any of the other citrus flavor, uh, scents I should say, not flavors, uh, like orange or lime or even grapefruit. So this is a good option. And I'm gonna add uh, about 12 drops And give that a mix. Now this last item that I'm going to be putting in is optional. And uh, but reason why I'm using it uh, is uh, in order to um, eliminate uh, from from seeing uh, having a difficult time seeing. Uh, in the in the window of the rinse agent compartment what actually I have in there like you don't have to it's an option for you uh, but I'm gonna put in a little bit uh, like maybe 
two or three drops of food coloring. And give it a mix. And this will help aid uh, clarity of seeing it in that compartment window. So it's a, it's a nice limey color. Uh, I actually like it. Uh, I didn't have yellow, or I did, and I just can't find it. So I figured, okay, what the heck. Lime, uh, lime color is just as good. Ooh, it actually smells really good. I'm surprised because of the alcohol, but the, the lemon really shines well. So then what you're gonna do is you're gonna put that in a, a container and uh, or some sort of squirt bottle and just uh, leave it in a dark cool spot a lot of people put put their uh, put their uh, jet dry or uh, rinse agents under the sink and that's where I'm usually gonna keep it so that's all you need nice and simple easy to make homemade and natural uh, so give it a try I'm uh, really looking forward to experimenting with it, seeing what it's like. Uh, I've uh, read up a lot about it. I've been done doing a lot of research, and basically, this is what natural um, uh, natural rinse agents uh, are, are made from. And because I've even I've read the labels, I've, I've done some research to make sure that it's more natural than what you get from the manufacturer. So uh, I'm going to give it a try. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one.